So David, victory in your first National League South match of the season, you must be delighted with that. Um, it's a really difficult game. Um, the boys had to work extremely hard against a very good side. Um, so we're very pleased to, to manage to get over the line. Um, two excellent free kicks and uh, the game was extremely close. But as I say, we're very pleased with the, with the result. Uh, Notice that the first 20 minutes was a little bit uh, kind of tight. Um, do you kind of expect that from your team, given it's the first competitive, first competitive it, league I, game? I thought the first 96 minutes was very tight. Yeah. Um, they came into it. Um, and we had some spells as well and it, I thought that overall it was uh, an even game that um, we managed to get uh, the right side of the line but I'm, I'm, I'm very pleased with the application and the attitude of our boys and uh, hopefully we can uh, maintain that and, and kick on going forward. And you've already mentioned Josh Ashby's free kicks. You must be delighted to have a player in a squad like that who can find the corners uh, every time we send yeah, the ball. Yeah, I mean today was fantastic, weren't they? Really good free kicks, so he's got a lot of quality. But as much as he made the difference with the, with the finishes today, I thought it was a, a really important collective team effort from the boys. They worked really hard. They, they, they tried to look after each other and, and make sure that people, uh, that people were, if somebody was making an effort, that we had support around them. And I think that collective sort of team effort is where we need to really concentrate on. Um, I noticed as well that Zach McEachern wasn't in the squad today. Um, I guess I gather he picked up a bit of a hamstring injury. Uh, you got no, any news on that? Not really, but he's not quite ready. Uh, but he won't be far away. Uh, and uh, fortunately, we've got one or two who could play uh, as well. So it was a case of um, just making sure that, that he was safe and that uh, we can make sure that we go together for, for the next game because the next game is going to be really important. Yeah, I was going to move on to that actually. Uh, got Chelmsford at the, the weekend. I mean, what do you think about that? Do you know yeah. much about them? Yeah, I, I'm... <laughs> Forgive me for being so generic and so kind of straight down the line, but I know these games are going to be really hard. Uh, we know they're a good side. We know that it's going to be a really difficult um, uh, proposition to go there and we need to make sure that we are concentrating on what we do, get our recovery in, get our session uh, done properly on Thursday and, and hopefully we can go in and, and put a, give a good account to ourselves. To ourselves. And then uh, finally, uh, this time next week, we'll have our FA Cup third qualifying round. We're drawn at home to Tamworth. What are your thoughts on the yeah, draw? Yeah, I know Tamworth. Um, I've played one game for Tamworth when I was at the back end of my career. I know it's a really good club. Again, I know it's a, a strong outfit that's going to be a real big test for us and, and we just need to make sure that we are recovering properly. But first things first, Saturday is the game for us. But if you don't mind, finally, I'll just like to mention the fans again. We are desperately missing them. It's such a shame that, that nobody's here. Hopefully the streaming worked okay and, and, and went through well and people could see. But uh, it's only a very small step for us, but a, a, an important one. And, and we are missing the fans uh, hugely. Well, thank you very much, David. I can tell you the streaming did go well. So I'm <laughs> oh, that's really good. That. Yeah, that's so, really uh, good. Yeah, we'll catch up with you again okay. on Saturday. Thank you, good time. <laughs>